There's an awful lot of chemists who are working in an area called catalysis, which is to try and make these reactions that make medicines faster. Uh, I'm one of those chemists, and we developed an area, uh, along with a number of other people, that allowed you to do this type of making medicines faster uh, by a completely different way. And so it's, I think that's the reason why they, were, they, they, they chose us. Uh, it was basically when I was a, a postdoc, I would be working with metals, and when you work with metals, it's a bit like if you imagine people in nuclear power plants are working inside these big boxes where you have to put your hands into these gloves and it's really hard to work. And I was really interested in the idea of, could you make catalysts that could exist out in the atmosphere that are completely robust and they're, they're not, you don't have to work in these big sort of boxes and suits, and would that have an impact on, on the world, hopefully? And we went off to try it, and it worked. It was great. I'm really just thinking about the way people would perform these reactions that allow you to make medicines, allow you to make materials, allow you to make lots of other things. At that point, we were just hopeful we could actually even come up, the concept would work, but we were also with an eye on, we hoped it would have an impact beyond that. Um, at the time, we, we understood that aspect of it. We knew that it would be more environmentally sustainable. So that was something we, we absolutely cared about from the very first, very first moment. And so we recognized that not only would it make it faster, cheaper, it would also make it that it would be better, better for basically environment, better for the world.